Hey everybody, what's going on? Eric here. Hope you guys are doing well out there. I'm doing pretty good. So I've been hunting down a new computer. I've been trying to look to see what's out there as far as PCs go, gaming PCs, whatnot. Something that can be upgraded later on with new hardware. And uh, yeah, still stay in with the, uh, the times, I guess. That's what you want to call it. So I've been looking for desktop computers get away from the laptop the dell precision m6800 has been a really good laptop all the upgrades and mods i put into it uh, new cpu more memory solid state hard drive and a couple other things i did with it as well uh it's been pretty good and i've had it for quite a few years but times are changing and time for a upgrade from what i already have so i've been hunting down online just anything I could find for a good PC at a decent price. Either something that's already built without the hassle of going to the store and without the hassle of having someone trying to sell, sell me something that they know nothing about. So I figured I'd just build my own PC. I've done it before. Nothing's really changed. Still the same type of components. You know, just newer forms of them. And, uh, yeah, but uh, I don't have the time to do it, and uh, I need it now. All right, so I figured I'll have somebody build me a PC instead of going through all the hassles. I don't have the time to do this. So I went to Cyber, Cyber Power's website. I've ordered from these guys before. They're having a President's Day sale for the U.S. So here are basically core components of a PC, of what you're going to need to get a PC kind of up and running. And then I'll go into the specs of this PC right here, which is not bad, but I did change uh, some of the things around on this thing with some upgrades. Um, I kind of want to be able to have the horsepower and be able to edit video or do stuff with audio and uh, not have to wait forever for it to render. Um, right now, if I use uh, CyberPower uh, or CyberLink, sorry, and uh, edit a 30 minute long video well it takes about 30 minutes long uh to basically come out with the final product of the video so i can post it on youtube so it takes a little bit so going through some of the things that this web this computer has uh, i don't need any of this shit. The cooling fans fine cpu is going to be a amd radeon 9 5900x uh this is liquid cool i don't have to go through this the GeForce GTX 3070 Ti for the video, 750 watt power supply, motherboard, I'm not going to change any of that, that's okay, uh, let's see, what else, memory, now, this is where I started making my first customization, so went from 16 gigs to a 32 gig, and uh, that's going to be a good upgrade, uh, for hard drives, you basically got, you know, what this thing's coming with, uh, five and then two terabyte. Um, don't need any of this, don't need any of this, don't care about any of this, don't need this, don't need this, don't need this, don't need this, uh, don't need this, don't need that. So the keyboard, I've got plenty of them, um, but I can always use a wireless mouse. I like my wireless mouses. Don't need headphones, don't need microphones. Uh, this I end up upgrading for a newer camera because I don't have one other than my one that's on my laptop. And then I like my Windows 10 Pro. So that's an upgrade. Well, actually, some would say that's a downgrade, but I kind of like that. So I was going through it, come out with the final price. Kind of filled in the blanks here to see what shipping was going to cost on this. And then going over all the, uh, everything that's inside the computer, just to make sure that the list is what I want. And after I confirmed everything that, yep, yeah, it's basically what I'm looking for, uh, go and make the purchase. So there's the order number, purchase date, and the amount that's paid. Confirmed it with my email. And uh, yeah, so now I just have to wait. So right now I got a little bit of an unboxing, and no, this is not the PC. It hasn't arrived yet. Been saving my pennies up for that, and uh, finally going to get the upgrade. 
So this is something else that I ordered. I'm going to try a different product for the epoxy resins. And this one is kind of got some really good ratings to it, reviews and everything else. So I'm going to end up using this possibly from now on. So you can see here, liquid glass, deep pouring epoxy. So we'll see how this works as far as uh, pouring it on top of a guitar. Ooh, look at this. Super clear. So it's a two-part mix, same thing like I was using before. It showed up today, and uh, yeah, so here's part A, and then here is part B, the hardener. So yeah, so I'm gonna try this out to see what it's gonna be like. I've checked it out online, and uh, I wanna see if this is gonna give me a harder, it's supposed to be a lot harder than what I was using, and uh, this is also UV resistant, so pouring this on a guitar, and if the guitar is sitting in the sun, maybe, you know, the UV isn't going to harm it, and, uh, yeah, so, I'm surprised this stuff isn't, like, freezing cold, because it was, was delivered today, so, yeah, I'm going to check this out, and see, uh, how this works, uh, thicker pour, ultra clear finish, uh, river, live edging, and wood tables, highest UV ra rating, uh, resistance, uh, easy color pigment mixing, self-leveling, and highest super wet gloss. Going to be some nice stuff. All right, guys, take it easy. Have a good one, and I will catch up with you all later.